in this video, I'm going to show you how to enable the public preview on Microsoft Teams. This feature allows you to enjoy the new releases, the new features in Microsoft Teams before it is generally available. I had this enabled in the early part of the year and I do enjoy it. All of a sudden, I realized I could no longer switch and how do I mean by that? When you come to this three dot button here, go to about. You should be able to see the developer preview here. I can't see it here. I don't know what happened. Something must have happened. I then went ahead to check, which I'm going to show you now. I had earlier published a video on how to do this. And if you follow that video, you will see some of the things and places I point to. The features, the options have changed because Microsoft have made some update. So in this video, I'm going to point you to how I'm able to you know, re-update it now. All right. So I'm going to log into Office Portal. Now I'm on Office Portal. Mind you, you must be an admin. I'm using my developer account, so I have the admin access. And here, when I click on it, it takes me to the Microsoft 365 Admin Center. Click on this Show All. We are interested in Teams Admin Center. So I'm going to click on Teams. You go to Teams and you see Update Policies. Like I said, I have two policies that there's organization wide and there's a public preview which enabled me to enjoy the public preview features. All of a sudden, I see everything now. There are options here. Follow office preview. So I'm going to click on this and click on edit. Right here, I labeled it public preview, but show preview features. I can see not enabled enabled and follow office preview. I think this is general preview features. So I have to put it on enable. Everything was default set to follow office preview. Given that last early this part of the year when I enabled it, it was just enabled or not enabled. There was nothing like the follow office preview feature. So now I'm going to change it to enabled and click on apply. So this policy has been updated. I'm going to click on it again and then manage user because I want to, you know, um, assign it to someone. Okay, this is Ola, Ola Nawaju I can I can add now. So public preview, users to add, yes. So I'm going to add it. So now I have added myself now and you can see public preview is enabled you may have to restart your teams so that i can pick that update for example right here uh, going back there does not necessarily mean i will be able to see it it's still not there if i even check for update that might not resolve it so it's good to close your teams quit and put it up again and that way you'll be able to see it. i'm going to do that right now i come back I'll get back to you now i'm done restarting my teams so when i go here and click on the about do you see i have the public preview options here but before i click on the public preview let me show you something what are the let's take for example the latest feature in teams now here is a chat from advance how are you today i want to respond do you see on teams I can't respond that there, there's no reply. Meanwhile, in the, that's the stable version, there's no reply. You can only reply on mobile. But Microsoft has added the reply option actually on desktop, but it's not generally available. But right now, I'm going to go here to this update about and click on public preview. It will show me some warning. I'm going to switch to public preview. All right, I'm back. One thing you will notice is at the top here, there is an icon at the top called P, meaning I'm currently on public preview. And of course, one of the features I said you will enjoy now, like the recent release, how are you today? If I click on these three dots, you can see reply. This option wasn't there before. So it's currently in public preview and you only enjoy it if you have that switched on. And not, not just this alone, another new feature in Teams that are currently being tested you have access to them when they are you know being released on before they are generally available so i can then reply i am good cool 
you know it's easy we've looked forward to this feature for a very long time and finally it's here but before you can enjoy it you need a public preview i think by the end of the month it will be in general availability or let's say by um, october 2021 it should be generally available but for now you can always enjoy it this way all right guys um thank you and bye for now